What's up you guys, my name is Cole and welcome back to another episode of What We Want Wednesday, the series where we as a Clash of Clans community come together and choose what we want put into our game. So basically how this works is I link Supercell's at in the title of this video and every time you guys hit the thumbs up button they will be notified on Twitter about this video increasing the chances of them seeing this and getting these updates put into the game. So if you guys enjoy my update ideas please be sure and hit that like button so they can see this and we can get our updates coming faster and faster. So with that being said, let's get right into the video. Alright you guys, so here is my first idea for the game and it is a very simple one and a very effective one if you ask me. So you guys know every time you go into battle and you use all your troops, you know, you deploy all of them on the screen, you get 100% victory or you get whatever percent victory you get or you get a loss, whatever it is. Um, and at the end of the battle, all your troops decide to disappear, whether they are alive or whether they are dead. Now in real life, if you were in a war, uh, you send all your troops out, some people die, some people come back. Now the people that come back are the ones that are still alive, so why shouldn't we have this in Clash of Clans? It only makes sense and would save us Dark Elixir and Elixir in the long run, and also our training time. So it really rewards the people that effectively use their troops and keep them alive longer and they can be reused in multiple battles until they are fully dead and this really just makes complete sense to me and I don't know why they haven't put this up in the game earlier but I hope they do so I hope you guys agree with this idea and let's get right into the next one okay you guys so here is the second and final idea of the episode now this one is a huge one and I really think needs to be put into the game for a lot of reasons so here we go so you guys probably know by now there are popular troop compositions that everyone likes to use, whether it is farming, whether it is war, whether it is just raiding for fun. There are so many different possibilities and good troop compositions that you know and always use when you're attacking. Now wouldn't it be a lot smarter if we could save that troop composition every single time, instead of having to go through our barracks manually training each and every troop, each and every spell, everything that is really annoying and a waste of time. Now I think it would be a lot more beneficial to be able to save custom troop compositions and you could be able to train a whole army with the click of a button and have it constantly training until you are done with it or until your army camps fill up. Now that makes perfect sense and would save us at least a minute or so every time we want to train troops because honestly I find it very irritating to have to go back and re-click all the buttons and sometimes uh, you get an off balance of troops and your army comp messes up and it's just a big pain in your ass so I think it would be very smart and effective if Supercell could do that where we could have custom troop compositions in our barracks and with that being said we could probably save up to at least five custom troop comps in our barracks and always have those as available to train so hope you guys enjoyed that second idea I really think it's a good one and definitely should be put into the game so if you guys enjoyed my ideas this week be sure and leave a like button on this video because as I said it will notify Supercell on Twitter and they hopefully will put these updates into the game so with that being said I look forward to seeing you guys tomorrow for another surprise episode of I haven't decided yet but it will be Clash of Clans comedy so with that being said you guys have a great day and as always people keep on clashing <laughs>